Australia, it will be this area. There's a very high Muslim population. Uh, there have been riots, crime issues, just integration issues overall. Now, I'm actually, despite popular belief, I like to look into things before I make up my mind. And the best way I do that is I go and I check it out for myself. Especially when all of the lefties in your country have been telling me repeatedly, Lauren, there is no problem. There is no problem. This is a diverse, beautiful, multicultural country. So I went and I checked out La Kemba. Within 10 minutes of getting there, someone had tipped off the media. That would be the police, uh, unfortunately. And they started running up to me and hectically screaming, why are you here, Lauren? Why are you here? It's perfectly normal. Of course, uh, in a perfectly normal street, I don't think the media would be chasing me down, but regardless, uh, within 20 minutes, maybe 15, I had not just the media following me around, but the police. And they crossed the street, came to speak with me, and told me, Lauren, if you speak to anyone in this neighborhood, you may be violating the law. If you criticize Islam in this neighborhood, you will be violating the law. I argued with him, I asked him to explain more, and basically I was told if you continue your walk through Lakemba to try and understand and discover the culture here, you may offend these people so much that they will get violent, they will attack you, and you will cause an issue here. And I will be responsible for it. I will be the one responsible if other people incite violence against me for my opinions. Now, that's, that's all well and good. Well, it's not well and good, but uh, it is. It is what happened. And this morning I was having a wonderful morning just sipping my coffee until I picked up a copy of the Daily Telegraph. 